Justin Rudolph here, Director of Baseball Operations for the United Shore Professional Baseball League. And as we prepare for the upcoming 2018 season, we've already been preparing for months. And in helping me prepare and ultimately to continue the success which we've had at the USPBL is in large part due to my staff. And I'm excited to announce that all of our staff for the upcoming 2018 is now final. We're gonna start by our baseball support staff and we're gonna start with our new field coordinator, Paul Nickerbricker. And Paul is coming to us from Delaware. He was recently inducted to the Delaware High School Baseball Hall of Fame. During his tenure in high school, he won multiple state championships and is recognized as one of the best development minds in the game of baseball today. Joining him is last year's assistant, or Beaver's assistant, Ray Ortega. Ray Ortega is now gonna serve as the catching coordinator and will also oversee the position player throwing. Ray has been instrumental in helping players like Greg Jones and Taylor Jelikowski refine their skill set as a catcher and ultimately help them become prospects. As we move forward to last year's 2017 champions, the Birmingham Beavers, Chris Newell is back and joining Chris Newell on the bench is former Diamond Hopper and All-Star shortstop Ricky Castro. Next we're going to go to the Diamond Hoppers. Paul Nochi returns and former USPBL pitcher Forrest Kumas will be joining him on the bench. We now go to the Mammoths. The Mammoths are bringing back manager Shane McCaddy and assistant Alan Oaks. And last but not least, we have the Utica Unicorns managed by Jim Messian and last year's Utica Unicorns first baseman, Willie Martin. We're excited about our staff this year. We've been working together already, going through our plan, and we can't wait for you to meet our new staff and to continue to help us support the USPBL. Thank you.